one of the best lady starters in the business on top of the ladder they're ready to go Lights are on, the first on RJ Peters Stakes Day. Very hazy conditions, the gates have opened back and they're off and racing. Specialism and Mia Dolce with the first to leave from Noble Impact and Jevelation. Gonna do beaten for speed but is now gathering some momentum and dropping out to settle down last of all is Sacred King. And so by the 750 in the grey, Specialism holds the front from Mia Dolce. Gonna do down on the inside next from Noble Impact, Jevelation back travelling fifth and a length and a half away behind them last is Sacred King. They they come off the riverside of the course, heading by the 550, and Specialism doing it well in front for Staples, brings them to the home corner, past the four. It's Specialism, a half a length clear, Mia Dolce. Going up now on the outside is Noble Impact. Gonna do behind those, Jevelation is next, into the straight, Specialism, called upon by the bullet, leads the way by a neck, Mia Dolce. A length and a half behind them, Gonna do dropping off Noble Impact, Specialism breaks away at the 100, he draws the whip, Specialism responds to it, and the great comes away and makes it an effortless two for two. Specialism beat Mia Dolce. Third close. Sacred King got busy late joining Gunner Do, then Jevelation and dropping out to run last is Noble Impact. Specialism. Safeguard Philly. Two for two. She has blitzed them here. She's won by nearly three over Mia Dolce having to be content with another second placing to this uh, running grey Specialism and uh, running up in part to its name. Jump in front, Staples controlled, and then he gapped them in the straight when he went for home. Boy, this filly's got a turn of foot. And down the outside from last, Sacred King came late to grab third and nose in front of the stable mate of the winner. But all honours with Specialism, who looks the real deal in the early stage of the two year old season. From the first crop of the safeguards and uh, has made a two for two out of the mare that's becoming a real breeding gem Clare Castle the second winner for the week for Lima Syndicate Harvey Crossman Laura Jordan Colin Brown chairman of Perth Racing and his Magumba Park Syndicate Paul Van Lowenhout Ian Freddie Johnson Keith Bev Bell Barry, Mrs. J.D. Bond, Rossi Fitzgerald, Gary Prater, Dallas Hogan, T.J. Morley and Brenton Moore and trained by Paul Jordan in 59.49 and she did it oh so sweetly. 59.49, two and three quarters the margin by a length and a half. And the numbers are 1436, 143 and 6 there, 190, 130, specialism, the Adolce, 220 and no third for Sacred King. OK, well, let's uh, quickly get out there now and uh, on Jarmies today once again, uh, our own Britt Taylor, and she's uh, quickly alongside of Bullet Staples after his all-the-way win on specialism. She looks really exciting, this filly, Britt. She does, Darren. Thank you. And Craig... It, she was so impressive on debut when she stepped out of that 400 metre trial, but how much improvement has she taken from that debut run to run and win today? Yeah, she definitely uh, has improved. Uh, I worked her during the week and it's hard to say they improved. I told Paul, I said, oh, on her work, she has, she's improved again. And he goes, well, because that's, that's pleasing, son. <laughs> How much easier was it today, drawing a good gate to just get to the front and that kick that she was able to give on the turn? Yeah, she show, she's been showing that. Last start, she did a few things wrong. She flicked her head up and gave me a bit of whack in the head. <laughs> but, um, you know, that's two-year-olds. At early starts, she's shown that she's uh, very mature and, and uh, improving every run. Well, with all things being equal, you'd imagine she can keep going on, and especially if you're still getting small fields like this, she could still be putting together a few more. I hope so. I mean, it's surprising the fields are so small. There's so many two-year-olds trialling, but I'll take it while I can. Well, well done. Thanks, Brittany. Yeah, well under the president, Craig Staples there with specialism. This filly by safeguard. Isn't this first year Cy doing a wonderful job? And this filly's unbeaten now. Um, safeguard out of a wonderful mare, Claire Castle. She's produced five Metro winners from five foals. Paul Jordan, on one leg's about to join us here. Jordo, congratulations. Hey, you were right on the money for the pun as you said she would win and she didn't let us down. Do I ever tell them lies? No, you don't. But I never get any, any envelopes come in the mail. Well, everyone, we'll give you a address after this, but you were <laughs> great on the radio there yesterday. Um, she's a filly going places. Well, she's a big, strong filly. Yeah. As Craig will say, it's like riding an older horse. Were you confident today? Obviously, she jumped nicely and she got just a wonderful kick. Um, how much more improvement in her? You said that she's improved dramatically since her debut win. 
Well, we just hope they keep improving. I mean, you know, like she's not eligible for the Magic Millions, so we'll see how she pulls up and she might run in the Crystal Slipper and then come back for the Jim Cracker nerves and the Caracalla Plate. But, but because she's, she can't run in the Magic Millions, she might as well, uh, might, might as well give that, that race a bit of a tilt. Now, her mum, 12 years ago, um, Harvey Crossman just told me, finished second in the champion fillies. I oh, know, what a bummer. Cut a choo-choo, came from Sydney. What a great David name. Hayes, and he, and he went back to Sydney. Next star beat Harada's son. They just syndicated for 36 million. I thought, how can you run in a champion fillies in Perth to get beat by something to beat Harada's son? Well, um, well, at least she's doing the job as a broodmare and producing fillies like this. No, no, it's really good. She's got a full sister. And she's got a, and she's in foal again to, to safeguard, and uh, she's got a, a war chant, just been foal. So, yep. you keep up that wonderful work. Job well done, Paul. Good on you, son. Thank there you. you go, son. Everyone, buy him a beer. Then he tipped the putters into it, and it gets the job done. Specialism defeats me, adult. She's sacred king third. Gonna do was back in fourth. One, four, three, and six. The first four numbers after the opening race here on Champion Phillies Day.